In this work, we present a mixed explicit semi-implicit material point method for simulating particle-laden flows. Our method captures the intricate two-way coupled dynamics for the interaction between fluids and discrete granular sediments as demonstrated by these examples. Two-way solid fluid interaction is very important in particle-laden phenomena. In this wind-blowing sand dune example, a one-way coupled simulation where sand does not affect wind fails to produce realistic dynamics. Our method, on the other hand, successfully captures the characteristic behavior of a sand dune migrating forward through accurate handling of the momentum exchange between sand and air. Here we summarize our contributions. We propose a unified framework for discretizing both incompressible fluids and particle-laden flows with the help of MPM background grids. A sub-stepping time integration scheme is introduced with accurate momentum exchange for the mixture of sediment particles and fluids, granting a larger time step to the fluid solver. We also develop a novel density evaluation strategy to convert between continuum sediment clumps and discrete sediment debris. Finally, our work includes a novel semi-staggered MPM incompressible fluid discretization method for locally averaged Navier-Stokes with a variable coefficient multi-grid preconditioned conjugate gradient solver. We discretize the governing equations for fluid and sediment materials with MPM. Materials are tracked with particles while forces and incompressibility constraints are computed on the grid. We use a semi-implicit discretization for fluid motion and symplectic Euler time integration for the sediment. The fluid can thus take a larger time step than the sediment. In a fluid step, particles first transfer mass and momentum to the fluid grid. We compute the fluid sediment drag force at grid regions that overlap with the sediment. Then, we apply a pressure projection to enforce incompressibility for the particle-laden mixture. The resulting velocities are transferred back to particles for their advection. In a solid substep, during the particle to grid transfer, we also evaluate the solid volume fraction and mass gradient at grid nodes. After computing elastoplastic constitutive equations on the grid, we evaluate the world space density at all particles, allowing them to convert between continuum and discrete representations. Finally, we interpolate velocities from the grid to the particles using the affine particle in-cell method and advec the particles. Our density evaluation strategy allows granular materials to naturally change their states between discrete debris particles and continuum clumps. This eliminates the grid-dependent volume gain artifact from previous works in MPM. Here we show more examples to demonstrate the efficacy of our method.